Would not want to have a nightmare about her. No, thank you. Aww. Aww. She's oh. like, no, she's like, stay away. Oh! Your sword broke now, too. Yep. <laughs> so, this is how it ends. Yes! <sighs> we have been on this journey for about six months. Hard to believe, but... Right? Yeah. Um, so, this will be the final episode mm -hmm. of Sailor Moon Stars. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, whenever Cosmos comes out, we'll be checking that out, too. But, yes. yeah, so the last episode mm -hmm. was just destruction with devastation. Yes. That's... We thought that the starlights were going to get killed off. Thankfully, they haven't yet. Mm -hmm. We also learned that we that Chibi Chibi was actually the light of hope, not Galaxia's Chibi Chibi, mm -hmm. because... Galaxia got t took over chaos, mm -hmm. and then she let her starseed go, mm -hmm. and then Chibi Chibi turned into that starseed, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so what else we had learned is that you know the three lights are or the star lights are very resilient. Oh yeah, that's very for resilient. Sure. And I have to say, like Galaxia telling them, "Hey, they ran away from their planet, girl. You destroyed their planet. Okay, mm -hmm. destroyed it." Yep. So, you know, that happened. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, we have Usagi being her wonderful, I believe in everyone, especially because yeah. we're senshi. Mm -hmm. We can come to an understanding, right? Mm -hmm. No, nah, Galaxia smacks her. What is up with these? What, why keep smacking Usagi? Right. And then, you know, she's going to use her light oh, from her star seed. And then, nah, she's not. Galaxia had it for a second. And then. Mm -hmm. Usagi gets to be transformed. She's laying mm -hmm. on the ground with her ribbons, which mm -hmm. was not so great. Yeah. But Chibi Chibi apparently is healing her, so mm -hmm. we're gonna see what happens. The only yep. thing we saw from the previous, from the trailer rather, is that she's in a white dress. Mm -hmm. She's in a sword. She's going after Galaxia. Mm -hmm. So who knows what's gonna happen? Yeah. But that. this will be the last episode, everyone. Episode yeah. thirty-four. Wild. We've been at this for a <laughs> while now, as you can tell. Uh, so yeah, excited to see how this is going to yeah. end. Yeah. Nervous to see what is going to go down i know we have out yeah it, it's it's wild that this is literally like the last episode of this for mm -hmm. now until cosmos comes out so yeah. oh boy oh boy oh boy all right, all right. Well, well jenny kb and we are going to be watching more sailor moon stars devastation yep so yeah so here we go what we did is <laughs> was getting a little bit back and so we decided we would record this the, the next day. day yeah new outfits i have this which you can no longer get, apparently. And the Uranus shirt that I had on. Yeah, it's gone. You, yeah, they're, they've public. been taken they, down. They took it down. Yeah. So, we're gonna go ahead and watch more of Sailor Moon Devastation. The last episode of Sailor Moon Devastation. Mm. Oh, those are so pretty. And yet... Is that Chibi Chibi's oh. voice? Oh, that's Chibi Chibi oh, voice. Chibi Chibi. Let me scoot forward so they can hear me. Yeah. Oh, oh that's not Galaxia. Why am I feeling bad for her? Look at her face. I... Mm. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Oh, and her voice and the It's like music. her soft voice and the music is doing her. And everything. I mean, so yeah, it's Chibi Chibi's doing Chibi Chibi things. Mm-hmm. Aww. Aww, she's so cute. Aww, her little eyelashes yeah. with her closed eyes. Oh. Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, that's right. She did get her silver crystal back, but uh oh, oh that awful light! Dude, How she dare looks you? dead, man. I hate oh. seeing that. Oh, oh, oh! Reverse. What's happening? Oh, hmm. Chibi Chibi is oh causing a really big beam of light. Whoa! A big pink beam of light. Yeah. Whoa! Okay, and now this. Right? <laughs> it's always like really intense. And then cute happy music and yeah, stars floating much. around. Oh, wow. oh yeah, Usagi. Hmm. Oh. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, my goodness. Hmm. Dude. She has like similar hair to Sailor Moon, though. You see that? Mm hmm. Yeah. Mm, the light of hope. Is that mm, Chibi Chibi? I have no idea. Hmm, and the butterfly. Well, yeah, but this is a pink butterfly, and like Kai's butterfly, which is red. Hmm. Mm. Oh. Oh. 
Wow. Oh, she got that dress now. Oh. The Let of Hope in this Galaxy. Aww. Oh. Oh. And now she's got a sword like Galaxia's. A sword? Yeah, yeah she's, she's like, like also a sword. Oh. Uh oh. She's not going to want to do that. Oh, no. She does not look into this at all. Ah! You gotta defend yourself at the very least, Usagi, though. Yeah, because... well, it does seem like it's evenly matched. It helped her yeah. to do ah! that. Oh, she's falling! She's falling! Oh, no! Oh, oh, no! no! Starfighter but... yelling. I know. Oh. It's like, you must do this thing. And she's like, no, I won't do it. Oh, oh, oh. my goodness gracious. Yes, defend yourself. Come on, mm -hmm. please. Oh! She got wings? Yeah, she got wings. Mm. No, how oh. impudent. How <laughs> impudent. Oh, oh, oh down oh. goes Galaxia. Whoa. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, nah. Uh. Oh. Uh. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, jeez, oh. OP. Them red glowy eyes that are flickering. She, no, she don't want to steal you away, though. That's the problem. Oh. Oh. Her bracelets are gone? And unlike anyone else, the and bracelets are, she doesn't go away. Yeah, that's what we would have thought would have defeated her, probably. Because she doesn't have her her um, star seed. That's how she looks. So we saw her looking like this in the preview last yeah. time. Yeah. we're like, is that her? It's her. It, it is her. It's She's good versus evil. Kind of in boss battle mode. Yeah. Looking even more scary. Yeah. And the voice. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. So chaos absorbed into her, and this is why she's like this now. Mm. She tried to save the world, and see what happens. Well, rather corruption. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, it seems like it. These sailor waters, though. Whoa, yeah, she looks pretty scary. Would not want to have a nightmare about her. No, thank you. No. The awful light of hope. Which apparently you were the light of hope. Hmm. Well, we kind of, mm. but still, so she's not gonna want it. Her body is yeah. completely mm. dominated by chaos. That's what you were thinking. Yeah, when she like yeah. absorbed, because she said she absorbed it or something. So she sealed chaos within herself. Ah, uh, yeah. It slowly corrupted her. Like slowly. Mm. A ray of hope. Aww. Which really seemed to be. Oh, Chibi Chibi. So is this Chibi Chibi talking to her? I mean, it must be. The light of hope is too late now. That's oh. that's very dire. Oh, wait. We've seen this girl before, but we saw her enshrouded in darkness with the color of the hair oh. colors. Oh. Uh, in the meantime, there's no time to think about that right now. Uh, She's not gonna stop. Yeah. Oh. Well, you have one too. <laughs> right. Nah, there's no way. Oh no 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 no! Oh, damn! Light of hope telling you to fight, mm. and you're just like again, nah. Mm. She's not wanting to do that. Mm -mm. She's just not. She's never going to. Mm. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! 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 oh. Who is that? That and oh that. Oh, oh. Or is it her hand? No. Did she stab her and by trying not to stab her? <gasps> Damn! Oh no! She feel bad. <gasps> she just broke the light of hope. Oh no! Oh no! Aww. Wait, what? It just—it's gonna. Re oh my oh. gosh! It was Chibi Chibi. Oh no. Oh jeez. Oh. 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 Gosh. Really? You're gonna say that? Mm-hmm. Oh, 
Fighting isn't the only way to settle things. Oh, <gasps> oh shoot. And then the happy stars. <laughs> is this really, like, the end? I can't even. Yeah. I, like, this is halfway through the last episode. Yeah, I know. It <gasps> doesn't, it just doesn't. No, she's not giving up, but she's not going to fight you. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Twisting the knife yeah. so hard. But Sagi's like, like, there's no way they're gone. Oh, I'm here again. Okay, I need a tissue. <laughs> here we go. Thank oh. you. Well, sorry. Oh, getting the a tissue. tissue's fell over. Oh, you lost that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I know, it's really emotional. Uh, do you need it? Actually, <laughs> are we gonna share one? <laughs> oh. Gosh. Look, it has my eyeliner on it. <laughs> it's like, oh. Exactly. Oh gosh. Oh, oh no! No, Black Lightning! I know, mm. right? Oh my gosh. Ah, oh. Uh, oh! Discarded your pride as a guardian. Oh, oh my gosh. She's just trying to hurl insults. So Saki's like, yeah, I will not be deterred. I know. Oh my god. Oh. Damn. Mm -mm. No, 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 mm -mm. no. Yeah. Oh, I won't give no. up. Oh. oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Like, what's this light again? Mm. Oh, can we see who this character is, please? Mm. Oh, she's oh. crying. Oh. oh, gosh. Oh, oh. it's Galactic. It's Galaxia. She pretty. Like a non-evil Galaxia. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all the star seeds. Uh, uh, is that like within her? Or? I, you know uh, what? We don't know. Sailor Moon's it's able to happening. Yeah, yeah uh, it's happening. Uh, she's losing all the star seeds that she's collected. Uh, uh, uh huh. Soggy dough. Oh. Mm. Even, Even you. you. She's oh. like, no, she's like, stay away. Oh! Your sword broke now, too. Look at her face, she's like, what? Oh! Oh! Mm. Yeah, no, this is um a lot of emotion. Oh my gosh. Oh, 
She broke out of chaos. Wow. Oh, chaos going somewhere else. Okay. Wow. Aww. You're like shining across the galaxy. Aww. Oh my goodness. Aww. Your light is gentle and very bright. Aww. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Chaos within everyone's hearts. Oh. Aww. She's gonna okay. go do that. Off she goes. So are we gonna get our people back? I mean, Although, one... I would think they're yes. all going back to where they came from, right? Probably. Yeah. Oh, it's Aww. lonely all by myself. No. 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 <laughs> Gosh, no, this definitely not this dream, time. No. Not this time. You're going to do no. this to us again. No, no it's not. Oh. Aww. 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 Where's Chibi Chibi? Mm, this girl yeah. let me to you. Uh, Chibi Chibi! Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh no, where's Chibi Chibi going? She going? Oh yeah, cause she was letting hope of Galaxia, right? So mm -hmm. she's probably going where Galaxia is. That's true. Oh, Chibi Chibi Do. Oh, wait, where's Guyu Do? The let of hope is with everyone's hearts. Oh, oh. And the will to believe. Oh my huh? gosh. Oh, yes. Oh. Yes. No, no, she was flirting with Yatin. Oh. Aww. Aww. <laughs> all thanks to your help. I was able to hang in there because of you. <laughs> Look at Sam's sad eyes. I know. I'm sad too, though. Oh, oh a blush. Oh. 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 Everyone else knows what she's. What is meant mm. except for herself? She got you there. Oh gosh. Mm -hmm. uh, she doesn't yeah. get it. Aww. Hey everyone. Aww. <laughs> yes, <laughs> Dan, best girl. Oh. oh, what did I say oh. wrong? Oh. You should know already. Oh. 
Till the very end, they're like bickering like I they know. do. I don't know. Yeah, it's nice to see it. <laughs> You're so mean, right? Aww. Aww. Oh. Oh, Mamoru. Saya talks to you. He does oh gotta protect gosh. her from now on. Mm -hmm. uh, just kidding? No! Oh! I know who she's talking about. Wait, what? I'm confused. Haruka had told it? her to protect her, right? Oh, oh they just ah! went back into. Oh, the starlight. Oh, hmm. oh my gosh. Oh. She's still 16 at the end of this. Oh, wow, I thought she was I older. I thought she was 17. Uh -huh. mm. <laughs> mm. Aww. Aww, iconic song! <sighs> oh, man. Oh. Mm. Right? Oh, yeah, they've been using a different oh! song. And now they went back no, to the original. No, I don't think we will skip the outro. Oh. No puzzle pieces to fill That's in. True. Oh, it feels weird. And there's no preview mm -hmm. coming. No, it's over. We finished watching it. Oh. Oh my gosh, the big trip. Yeah. Oh gosh. I know. There's so much motion. <laughs> so emotional. Oh. Oh. The kitties. A stuggy out taking a cat nap. Oh, it's so cute. It is so cute. <laughs> yes! <laughs> the starlights. <laughs> they all go travel together. To return. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, oh. the chibi chibi! Oh, that's. Oh. A, I, I feel like it's just a mix of like being really emotional mm -hmm. from the things that happened mm -hmm. and like the light of hope being mm -hmm. restored and mm -hmm. like. Uh, and the fact that she was able to like turn back galaxia to who yeah. she was before yeah that's even like the biggest like boss <laughs> battle she was able to um even <sighs> her like bring her around the light of hope it's just like the messages of like hope and yeah and, yeah yeah and like loneliness but then like mm -hmm. her friends come back it's just like, all of that hits, as well as the fact that, like, we've been watching this for, like you said, at least six months. Yeah, at least six months, I and feel like. And now it's just, been, like, it's, it's over. getting to the end, and, like, there's no preview for the next yeah. episode. It's just, like, hitting me so hard. Yeah, well, I mean, if you think about it, we grew up with this, right? Yeah. We grew up with this, and when 
this was out, we had no idea about this because, you know, we didn't have access to something like this. It was in Japan, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it's been on, like, so, you know, I forget how before initially ended. Honestly, I don't remember, like, when they stopped seeing it in America. Mm-hmm. And then, you know, this eventually did come out. I think it was, like, 2016 or something like that. I'm not mm-hmm. sure. Um, but, yeah, it's a long time, right? Because mm-hmm. Sailor Moon's been out for such a long time. We were really little. Mm-hmm. And, like, to see everything come to a... But it's always a feels, too. It's like, Usagi never gives up on anyone, right? Yeah. Galaxy has done some seriously unredeemable, in my opinion, qu- things, right? Mm-hmm. Like, seriously. She killed her friends off, right? She's yeah. destroyed planets. She's trying to take mm-hmm. over the world. Granted... She is the Sailor Guardian, Legendary Sailor Guardian, and she also did take chaos into her, and then mm-hmm. she knew what was happening to her, so she let her star seed turn into the light of hope, go somewhere else, which mm-hmm. was smart, because if not, well, that would just be the end of the world, as we mm-hmm. know it pretty much. Mm-hmm. Right. So she couldn't keep fighting this chaos off her. So mm-hmm. she has a lot of stuff that she's dealing with. It sucks, and she was alone. Mm-hmm. And we got a little bit of her backstory. I think right. there's um one of the trailers we had watched for Cosmos. I think they talk a little bit more about her backstory. So mm-hmm. it seems like she got a pretty hard life. Yeah. And again, she says she's alone, right? Mm-hmm. So that's like really sad itself too Mm -hmm. but then you start to see like she's starting to get hope too like you see her self with her long pretty hair Mm -hmm. and even she's trying to believe and it's Mm -hmm. it's hits yeah it hits hard and Mm -hmm. you know i do believe that chibi chibi light of hope was that sword which Mm -hmm. i really and she's like hey listen you have to fight you have to fight the light of hope is telling you to steal her away Mm -hmm. so no Mm -hmm. she's not going to she's this is how she is right It's just, it hits. And then, you know, mm-hmm. after she, the big, big battle's done, and mm-hmm. she's like, Galaxy is no longer bad, mm-hmm. and she's given her mission to go return the star seeds. Mm-hmm. she is just standing there, like, holding herself. She's alone, right? Mm-hmm. She's really up. So it does hit, and I can see why. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, all, everyone comes back, and you're just yeah. like... Yeah. And then she's like, is this a dreaming? No, no more dreams. <laughs> no more dreams, please. I can't handle any more dreams. Yeah. So it, it does, but we've been covering this for six months. So yeah. it, to get to this point yeah. and how good the story is written and how yeah. emotional it is, it's not surprising that we're like this, yeah. right? And like the starlights too. Oh that, my god! You know they've been fighting so hard for mm-hmm. so long, mm-hmm. and then like they had lost their princess and they yeah. get their princess back and they're gonna go like restore, yeah, and rebuild their planet. Yeah, it's just really like, oh gosh, yeah. <sighs> Yeah, it is ha- you know. Yeah. I'm happy for them. It is. It's happy, right? Mm-hmm. And it's it's overall it's, it's crazy because like goodness gracious, this has been such a wild, crazy ride, you know. But it had mm-hmm. a happy ending, which is always is nice. I mean, with Sailor Moon, you're generally gonna get a happy ending because just how right, it is, right? Yeah. So, I had I, I felt like that they would come back. Yeah. If they didn't come back, that would have just been really sad. Yeah. More so, so like Usagi got Momo back, mm-hmm. and then. All her friends came back. Yeah. It's funny, the outers are still, like, off doing their own I thing. know, right? We see them all, like, say goodbye <laughs> to <laughs> the Starlights and Caillou, and they're just like, nah, bruh. <laughs> the outers always do their own thing, though. Like, we're cool kids. You know, we have a kid. We're yeah. gonna go do our own cool kid thing. But, like, for them also, they have their little family together That's again. Really and cute. they're just like, yeah, yeah. We, we don't have anything to wish for. Like, we, yeah. everything is, like, good for us now. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. no, this was a very, especially. Especially, like, this, I don't even know how many episodes. Someone will tell me. Grace can tell me that this has been, like, <laughs> devastation. Right? So it's just been, like, ups mm-hmm. and downs and ups and downs. And then just, yeah. shoo, with the feels yeah. department. Mm-hmm. And now it's just happy. And it's, it's out. And it's over. I'm glad you, like, explained to me what Sam was talking about at the end was, like, protect her or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because so, Haruka, when... Some bastard told me that. was not like, what is Sam talking about? You're like, oh, it's so about Yeah, she's talking Haruka. about Haruka. Haruka, yeah, But it's interesting, sure. like, you know, also, like, Sam, and Haruka, and... Uranus and Starfighter. Mm-hmm. Like, even before they knew each other, they both, like, hated each other. Yeah. Well... And then in the end, like, mm-hmm. it really does seem like they gained this sort of respect for one another. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they, they did. They have a lot of... They have a lot of, in common with them. The two like, of them, similarities. For sure. They have a lot of similarities, yeah. yeah. Uh, I dare say that, you know, even there's some similarities to, say, a Mamoru, because, you know, how much I really like Mamoru. Mm. Um, you know, I, I, whatever. It's like, whatever. You can mm. like him, whatever. I, I guess my biggest complaint with him is just, like, especially at the end to me, it's like, it's like can you tell me how much? I'm like, just tell her, dude! Uh. She's been going through so much. First, you're trapped in a mirror world, then you're gone to America, then you mm. f- she finds out you were dead. Mm. Stop it! Mm. Anyway, whatever. Yeah. I, I, I just am like... Happy everyone's back. Yeah. Happy Usagi's happy. I mean, he's, like, an introverted guy, so I think that's part of it. Mm. Like, Mamoru, um, he is, like, you know, very into his studies. Mm-hmm. He's very, like, 
Um, so Usagi kind of like always kind of like pulls him out. Yeah. Like, pulls him out to like because she's like the soft, loving one. And that's something else that really hit me about this mm-hmm. um, ending is that she was given a sword and like she didn't want to use it. No. And it's like to me, swords like are a very phallic symbol mm-hmm. and something that's used in like a very masculine mm-hmm. form of fighting. And, um, for her, it's, like, not her way. She's very, like, soft and feminine. And even her fighting style Mm -hmm. is, like, through the power of love. Yeah. And then even, like, Chibi Chibi has, like, pink, like, power, like, whoo, like, expanding. And so, to me, like, it really is significant to see that there's this character that's really, like, the main character that's fighting for good and fighting for justice and pushing for all the things that she mm-hmm. um, stands for, but in a way that's very unique um, and very feminine, in a way that's, like, filled with love, filled it with hope, filled with belief that things could be better, and just showcasing, like, how powerful and significant those things are. Mm-hmm. And, like, I really feel that the world that we live in often undervalues those Mm -hmm, kind of mm -hmm. things, right? Like, I feel like a lot of, like, especially us women are, like, pushed to take on a lot more masculine roles Mm -hmm. um, and shown that this is the way to be more powerful, right? But then to be like, you can be powerful. Of course, like, at the time this came up, came out and also the time we were growing up was very girl power yeah right so we really had a lot of that growing up it's like you know you can do it like your way like you go girl kind of thing yeah um and I really it it really touched me to see her like in all her feminine glory wearing this white gorgeous dress like being like I'm not gonna use the sword and I'm gonna use like the power of love the power of friendship, Mm -hmm. the power of hope, Mm -hmm. like, all of these things that really are so, so significant, and it's kind of, like, make life worth living, and she Mm -hmm. was fighting for the world where she says, I met, like, all these people, like, I fell in love with all these people, like, you know, all these things happened here on this planet Earth, and so it was very personal to her in that way, um, so she's fighting in her own way, like, in all her feminine glory. <laughs> That's what Usagi is, though, because she's not, yeah. you know, the Flight of Hope is basically telling her, seal her away. You must be, there's no time. You can't think about this. You have to seal her away, right? Yeah. But, no, because Usagi doesn't want to. She wants mm-hmm. to try to understand. She wants to reach out, and she always believes she can. Mm-hmm. There's always more of the way than fighting, and she's mm-hmm. not wrong about that. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, it's like, but you've lost so many people. She's just such an interesting character, right? Because she's lost yeah. so much at this point. Mm-hmm. Yet she's still willing to be like, hey, listen, I'm not going to use a sword against you intentionally. She did stab her by accident. She felt bad about that. Mm-hmm. Like, she's like, oh, no. You know, the yeah. sort of uh, sort of light. The light of hope is telling her, hey, you've got to do this. And she's fighting against the light of hope, right? Mm-hmm. What's bestowed upon her. So mm-hmm. it's kind of like, mm-hmm. it's crazy. But that's the Usagi way. And mm-hmm. then the sword turns out to be Chibi Chibi. And you're just like, oh, oh, shoot. Okay, mm-hmm. that's really upsetting. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then Chibi Chibi just disappears, right? They don't mm-hmm. die, they disappear. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, overall, though, like, that's very Usagi. And if mm-hmm. had she not done that, it would be very, like, weird to see that. At least anime Usagi. I know some people have said that Chris Usagi, like, does kill, but to be honest with you, I don't remember that. Yeah. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see when Cosmos... It's been a while since we watched yeah, it. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see, like, whenever Cosmos mm-hmm. comes out, if that is the case, and then mm-hmm. they'll just be like, oh, mm-hmm. wow, that's different. Right. But the Usagi that we know from the, this anime, she's mm-hmm. not like that. She's mm-hmm. like, here's an under- let's come to an understanding. Always. She always believes in win-win, mm-hmm. always tries to see the good in people. She does, which I, yeah. I know some people are like, oh, that's so annoying. I'm like, no, it's really not because that's her character trait, <sighs> right? right? And like, I think girl's... that, like, imagine if more people were like that in the world, like, mm-hmm. what the world would be like yeah. if more people looked for the good in others, yeah. looked for the win-win yeah. situations. Yeah. yeah, like, she's just... 
is so resilient in mm-hmm. her belief that like it can work out for everyone. Yeah, she gets a crap beat out of her, find a way. Mm-hmm. and she has all this loss, and she's still mm-hmm. like, "Hey, listen, I'm here to listen to you. Let me extend my hand out to you." You know, mm-hmm. so I mean, I feel like that's very powerful in itself because not yeah. a lot of people will be like that. A lot of people are like, "Hey, you hurt me, I'll hurt you." Right? Right. It's very yeah. much what that's like, but not Isagi. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that was very powerful. I mean, I was on the thing of Galaxia that she can't be. She's just done so many terrible things. Yeah. But honestly, it's like she was being corrupted by chaos mm-hmm. so it really wasn't her mm-hmm. she was her then she gave her light of hope away her star seed mm-hmm. and then because she wanted to have a backup plan mm-hmm. and you could just see like how she's like oh i've done so many terrible things how could i come back i'm glad she didn't die mm-hmm. right because mm-hmm. at first i'm like man maybe they should and i think i did say a couple episodes yeah she needs to just go just go mm-hmm. but honestly like that really wasn't her it was corrupted yeah. her so it's different mm-hmm. uh, so yeah girl got a lot mm-hmm. on her shoulders like dude talk about being like the legendary stellar guardian and like right. doing everything on her own she doesn't have her yeah. own like group that's crazy because right. she's legendary and therefore she's the most powerful so- sailor senshi probably mm. uh, but yeah dude this hits them hard this was yeah. so good and like i'm gonna miss miss these because yeah. it's been so fun mm-hmm. but you know what cosmos will eventually come out and then we yeah. can be in pain all over again yeah and what I was going to say is that if Usagi had distra- destroyed or used the sword, <laughs> used the sword against Galaxia, like, would she have gotten her friends back? I don't think so. I think not, because mm-hmm. I think the reason might have been is because she had to get, like, let's call her inner Galaxia to mm-hmm. kind of, like, release yeah. the star seeds. Because let's mm-hmm. say she did kill Galaxia. It's just not, who's to say the bad end, right? Mm-hmm. It's like, okay, she did what the Light of Hope wanted, now she's gone. Mm -hmm. Great, now everyone else is gone too. Mm -hmm. So I do find it so interesting though that Galaxia is just that powerful that without her bracelet, she was Mm -hmm. able to still be around. Mm -hmm. Because as we know, when those bracelets are gone, Mm -hmm. they just are gone. But nah, she's... (laughs) Listen, whatever. I I mean, I'm glad she's off doing her stuff now. Mm -hmm. Legendary Silicardian. Guardian. That (laughs) hair though! Oh, yeah. It's pretty. <laughs> Galaxia with hair up. Evil. Galaxia with hair down. Good. <laughs> this is how much having a good hair day can change your yes! life. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, man. She should be in a hair commercial. <laughs> she should be. She's trying to keep your hair up and tidy. <laughs> Use our product. I know. Let your hair flow free. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. too can save the galaxy. <laughs> There you go. Good hair can save the galaxy. Good hair can save the galaxy. <laughs> yeah, no, man. I'm just, I'm glad oh, I was happy ending. Because you just never know how this stuff's going to go down. You just know. never know. Yeah. But and, like, it was happy for everyone. Mm-hmm. It's honestly, like, uh, yeah. I wish I could see more of, like, their lives after this. Like, the the slice of life side of things. It would be of, like, so fun. Yeah, of all the friends going back and, like, planning their futures. Yeah. Um, I did think that they were so because they're 16 at the beginning of this season so i was thinking that they were 17 at the end of it yes not um, yeah i guess not maybe in the manga it's different maybe um, in the manga because i had read somewhere online i was like looking up their ages in mm-hmm. this and they were thinking that by the end of this season um that they were 17 but in the end she says she's 16 she's 16 she's, so, still 16 she's still 16 so that means that not that much time really has passed since then right it's uh, months and months this though. just feels like it's so much longer months. yeah it's months because but Mama it feels Ruth's so much gone. longer than that yeah. though because of all of the stuff that they've been through the and everything happens. like that too yeah. i'd would love to have a like a spin-off if it's not like necessarily animated but like mm-hmm. manga version or anything of just like when the starlights and Kaiyu go back and they rebuild con- their their home you know i think i would be sad to see like Starfighter move on without Usagi. <laughs> and then also, like, e- even as she moves on, she's probably pining. Listen, so... Usagi can go there too, okay? Oh. It doesn't have to be like that. <laughs> it oh can be an gosh. alternate universe. An alternate See? universe. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah cause oh I know one gosh. of the really big Mamo ships is uh, Mamo and Satsuna. And I'm like, you know what? That's fine. They can get together <gasps> oh somehow in this alternate universe, and then Usagi can go find Seiya or Starfighter, and it can be oh great, right? My gosh. That's why it's an AU, guys. It's an AU. Right. It doesn't hurt canon. It's it just doesn't an hurt alternate canon. universe. Okay, okay. You want to see it happen? <laughs> so badly. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, but I would love to mm. have more of their backstory because I feel like it would be so interesting because um, we really don't know much about them. Yeah, mm. we've gotten to know these characters these months, but we really just don't know, like, they were pre- their previous life. We know they mm. went through some stuff for sure. Yeah. You know, because it seems like Kaiyu is the only one that had similar powers to Usagi that could stop the phages. So mm-hmm. it's like they definitely had to kill, and they're just like, oof, yeah, the rough times. So so you've explained what it is you want to see happen. You all, if you have 
links to pictures, links to fan fiction, links to anything that would help KB <laughs> <laughs> live out her fantasy dreamland. Um, ah, definitely that would be let us so know. Nice. And and a reminder that we do have the Seusa Fans United. Facebook group. We do. Yeah. It's mm-hmm. wonderful. Yeah. I've written a few fanfics already. I know. I have another one that I'm working on. Let's say Anusagi. Um, so we could link that somewhere. Link my, um, or, I mean, it's like our account, but I'm yeah. the one who writes. <laughs> she writes beautiful fanfiction. Um, yeah. We can drop that link down somewhere below in the description, in the comments, and in, in places. Because <sighs> um, I have a few that I've written so far. Mm-hmm. The first three I wrote for her when I was going out of town. It was so sweet. Yeah, I was going out of town, <laughs> and I wasn't going to have phone service, Um because it was international, and I decided I didn't want to um, have phone service during that time. I have a little tech-free time. <laughs> and so what I did was I wrote three, because I was going to be gone for three days, wrote three um, short fanfics for KB of Seiya and Usagi to keep her company while yeah. I was away. So every day, like I preset an email every day uh, to come at noon. And yep. so you would get a fan fiction. I think it's noon yet. Noon yeah. Yet, noon yet, noon yet. And then she was the one who encouraged me to post them online. She's like, really, there's not enough. So you said fan no. fiction. So she's like, you need to post this online. Yes. So, yeah. You're so I'm, pretty. Yeah, I am working on another one. No idea when it's going to be finished. Uh, you, she was looking at me the other day. I'm like on my phone with it up, pulled up. And she's like, are you, what are you doing? <laughs> are you writing a fan fiction? And I was like, uh, kind of. <laughs> it was like, actually, I was just rereading what I had already written so far of that one. Um, so I do plan to release it, but I I didn't add much to it. I added like a sentence. A sentence. So I was like, okay, wh- where did I leave off? I had to reread everything up leading up to that point. Um, but yes, we'll link that below and also our group, our mm-hmm, Facebook group, mm-hmm. uh, Sayusa Fans Unite, which has been really interesting. Like, I had mentioned that we didn't find any Seiyusa groups. Mm -hmm. Actually, that's not entirely true. Mm. So, I found a ton of Seiya fan groups, especially, um, that were in Spanish. Mm -hmm. Because at the time that we saw the other Sailor Moon seasons, Mm -hmm. they, in Latin America, also showed season five. Mm -hmm. Which they decided that we were too delicate (laughs) to possibly understand <laughs> these gender dynamics of this season, mm-hmm. and uh, they decided not to release it here for a very long time. Yeah, people are mad, but like... they did release it to Latin America. So I have since then joined a few groups. Mm-hmm. Um, the fan art is amazing. They're all the time sharing fan art, like, and a lot of them grew up with this mm-hmm. because when they were young, they were able to see this, unlike us who didn't get to see it. For me until now, for you, it's been like a year. A year be. or two, yeah. A year or two. Um, so I didn't get to see this until now. So um, my Spanish is questionable. <laughs> Um, <laughs> questionable. <laughs> questionable. I grew up speaking Spanglish, so I was trying to get into one of the groups. I had to ask my mom to help me. <laughs> so cute. I was like, Mom, I'm trying to get accepted into this group so I can see the fandom stuff. Um, can you help uh, me? Like, it had, like, the questions, mm-hmm, right? Um, mm-hmm. I was like, Mom, can you help me answer these <laughs> questions in Spanish? So my mom helped me. Um, so cute. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So cute. And she hasn't watched any of this, but she reads my fanfic, some of them. I'll send her the ones that I think are, like, mom appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> mom appropriate. Right? Fiction. Like, the ones that are just, like, cute romance. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, of course. Um, and so, and she likes reading them. Mm-hmm. She got confused last time because I had say I call Usagi Odongo and she's like who is Odongo is that another girl <laughs> it was so cute um but yes yeah, so um but the main thing was that we hadn't found that in English mm-hmm. so I'm enjoying seeing the pictures and sometimes knowing what's being said mm-hmm. like I said I grew up speaking Spanglish but my definitely primary language by far is English mm-hmm. people sometimes write comments in Spanish and sometimes I know what's happening and sometimes I don't <laughs> Hey, you're honest. (laughs) Right? You're honest. (laughs) Um, But yeah, definitely glad that we watched this. Yeah. Happy with the ending. Yeah, yeah, happy with the ending. As happy of an ending as we could have expected. I did. 
Honestly, like, I did kind of always think Mama was going to come back. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, yeah. Kind of was like, okay, he's gone, okay, he's gone. And, like, if you hadn't explained to me that he had disappeared in the first place, mm-hmm. I, I probably would have missed it, mm-hmm. honestly. Mm-hmm. Um, it happened really fast. Yeah, it happens really fast. And yeah. then you don't really find out, like, really what happens to him because it just, like, it shoots the, phew, and then the plane, mm-hmm. and then that's it, right? And then Jan yeah. says the star is faded, right? Yeah. And then it's, like, many, many episodes later... When she finally reveals that Mamoru is Starseed, and then uh-huh. you see what actually happens. He turns uh-huh. his tuxedo mask, and then mm-hmm. he's just wrecked. Because, mm-hmm. uh, you know, she's a legendary Sailor Guardian. I mean, yeah. you know, she's very powerful, and yeah, that's all it Ugh, takes. Yeah, but I, I do think this is as happy an, of an ending yeah. as we could have gotten. Yeah. It was very, and even the ending was very, like, Seusa, because it's still, like, Seo being like, I'll never forget you. Yes. Yeah. yes. Usagi being like, I don't know what's going That's on. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> Alternate universe Usagi knows what's going on. Uh, okay. No, no. But Usagi also didn't know what was going on when Mamoru was like, here's a ring that I'm going to put true. on your finger. I put a picture of this, by the way. I'm wearing the ring you got me. Yeah. It has like stars and moons. It's really pretty. Um, let me try and hold it really close there. You can see it. It was like little stars and moons. Yeah. Um, but I put a picture in the Seiusa group. Yeah. Um, that she got for me uh, because they reminded us of Seiya and Usagi. And it's really pretty. The stars and moons. And it's really pretty. It's really and pretty. it's rose gold. I like rose gold. Yeah, she has rose gold too. Yes. And so. she likes stars and moons in general. Yeah. So that being said, mm-hmm. we will well, thank you so much for joining us on this wonderful trip. But yes. we have more coming. Yes. So. Mm-hmm. We have been talking about this a little bit, Mm -hmm. and you've probably seen me have, like, I think it's, like, two trailers, because there's only two trailers out for the new Madoka movie. Mm. And Jenny hasn't seen the previous Madoka movies, Yeah, and she has seen Madoka. The anime. But that- A long time ago. A long time ago. It's been years. It's been years, so. It kind of happens to me, too. I would guess, like, five years. That's a long time. Like, I don't remember everything. (laughs) I remember a lot of things, but not everything. And I remember less than you, usually. Yeah. Like, I I don't- But honestly, Mm -hmm. I have- I don't remember completely everything about Mm -hmm. Madoka. So, Mm -hmm. we're going to be- Not not the anime, because the anime, again, is 12 episodes. I feel like, because eventually the movie will be coming out sometime in 2024. Who knows Mm -hmm. when it'll come here. Mm -hmm. My understanding, though, when they did release the Madoka movies, which mm-hmm. basically is just the retelling of the anime, they did release them in the theaters, so that would be kind of cool. Anyway, so there's a total of three movies. There's the first one, which I think mm-hmm. is the first part of the anime, and then the second one, which is the last part of the anime, and then mm-hmm. the third one, which is Rebellion. Mm-hmm. And then the sequel will be towards Rebellion. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, so we're going to go ahead and react to those next yeah. for our Magical Girl Fridays. Yes, and, the Magical Girl but, Fridays. I you know, love it. If you've never seen Madoka, uh-huh. welcome with us, because yeah. it's a wild ride, mm-hmm. and I will definitely like say some disclaimers when we start watching that it. That I remember. <laughs> that I do remember, because yeah. I really didn't know. I went into it, and the first episode, I was like... This is so freaking yeah, cute. Like, yeah. how can you watch this and not be happy? Like, it's Madoka's I mean, adorable. the opening is cute. The yeah. character style is cute. The yeah. music is cute. So, yeah. quite frankly, but then some shit goes but then, down. Yeah, that stuff yeah. goes down. So it's like ever since Madoka, it's kind of like okay, cute magical girl anime. Not, I don't trust that. We don't trust that. Like, magical actually. girl raising project is another one of those. It's just like, bro, what is I know, this? I know. So look forward to Madoka next. Mm-hmm. And like I said, it's gonna be the movie, so it's gonna be a lot smaller which is fine because honestly like you know it's Madoka and I think 12 episodes might be too much (laughs) (laughs) I honestly don't think I've ever seen the Mm -hmm. anime movies condensed though so I'm curious to see exactly how they go about it so that'll Uh be new for me Uh and honestly I don't remember the last time I saw it was years ago when I saw Rebellion Mm -hmm. and it's been years since Rebellion Mm -hmm. because now we're gonna get the new movie yeah. And it looks so good. Yeah. It looks so good. Like, mm. I... S- it lo- it's so funny. We did the last reaction. I was, like, horrified. It looks <laughs> scary. And you were just, like, so excited. It has, like, definitely horror elements. Listen. I was like... Ooh. Listen. And you're like... Ah. <laughs> it's, 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 you know, it's interesting because it's just, like, oh it's a magical anime, right? So a lot mm-hmm. of, this was, like, in 2013 in the Madoka? I don't remember. <laughs> but it's, like, oh, happy-go-lucky music and everything. Yeah. And you're, oh, it's going to be such a cute, fun, magical anime. Because, honestly, <laughs> I like stuff like Precured, which I know people mm. are like, wait, really? You like Precure? I'm like, listen, the Precure is cute. Uh, of course, I haven't seen that in a very long time either. Now, that uh, is actually good, too, but also is dark. But uh, uh, Madoka is some serious is darkness. It? Uh, what I saw of it looked really cute, but it tricked you? It, tricked, it would trick uh, me? Not like Madoka does. Not like Madoka no, does. Madoka Madoka, in my opinion, it, unless there's anyone of you who can think of another anime that you're just, oh my gosh, this took it. What the hell just happened? <laughs> what am I watching right now? Right. Um, so, yeah, this is going to be really great. Mm-hmm. I mean, I still, I know some of the people in the comments are like, oh, Sayaka looks beautiful with her face like that. I'm like, bro, what happened to Sayaka? Like, oh, 
<laughs> Dude, it's going to be a wild ride. You yeah. know, they had talked about it, too, and I don't know if they still will do this because it was years ago. Talking mm-hmm. about just making a slice of life Madoka, which I'd be like, that would be so nice to yes. get a break from all the craziness. Please. But who knows if that'll happen. Uh, we, I do know that Madoka is huge in Japan. even has its own mm. magazine. So, wow. you know, I have friends like, you're going to come watch the Rebellion movie in Japan? No, I'm going to wait for the Rebellion <sighs> movie to come out over here. Oh, you know, because... Uh, Madoka. Mm-hmm. So anyway, that'll be our next anime for Magical Fridays. Yeah. And then eventually when Cosmos comes out, we will we do know, like I said before, it's out in DVD, but we still have no oh. sub or dub. Or and, and no like announcement. And no as announcement. To when anything is coming. Which is interesting because mm-hmm. when Eternal came out, I did some research and apparently like Eternal came out before the DVDs came out. So I'm like, huh, interesting, mm-hmm. interesting. So whenever we find out when that comes out, we'll react to it. Yeah. But for now, this is the end of our Sailor Moon oh, journey. It's okay. Yeah. We will not say goodbye to it. We will say farewell for now. Yes, that. And then we'll be doing Madoka. <laughs> and we're going to buckle you up for Madoka. Oh. It's going to be a wild ride. Okay. Well, it'll be fun. Sometimes people think it's fun when, like, someone's, like, freaking, like, ah! I mean, so, I kind of felt like it's fun, too. I don't know if anyone's ever, like, heard it. There's a video game series called Amnesia, mm-hmm. and it's a horror game. Mm-hmm. And I remember, I haven't played it personally, mm-hmm. but I do remember watching, like, people on Twitch and YouTube reacting to it, and, like, mm-hmm. grown men, like, crying and falling away, because it's horrifying. <laughs> oh, my God. And I'm just like, why can't I stop watching this? Right. Like, I feel bad for these men. Oh. They're, like, terrified. Oh. But oh. I want to keep watching it. <laughs> I remember this oh one guy, gosh. he was like this, he threw his control, ran out of his room, and I was like, Dude, yeah, that happened. was some stuff. Yeah. No, that's a really dark game, honestly. Oh. Honestly, I, I don't know if I'd play it. Yeah. I like to watch people reacting to it, right. apparently. Mm-hmm. That was years ago, too. So mm-hmm. it's kind of fun to like watch like if it was like a horror aspect or something, you see people's reactions. Yeah. And you're not really a big horror fan. You know what? I'm not a fan of direct horror, but I like things with horror influences. Sure, you like Stranger Things. I like things. that kind of like dark aesthetic. Yeah. yeah. I love Vampire Diaries. Oh, yeah. Which is, you know, more of an urban fantasy with yeah. horror influences. Yeah. So I like things like that. But anyway... We are going to go. It is actually a day of recording this, Christmas Eve, and we were like, that's why we were trying to re- record last night, but honestly, I was getting stressed because I was like, it's getting dark, it's going to be dark soon, like, let's hold off and do it yeah. tomorrow. But we did spend our Christmas Eve recording this so that we could enjoy this ending. What a way to spend uh, Christmas Eve, though. I know. Honestly, mm-hmm. the ending of the Sailor Moon anime. Yeah. It's so emotional. I know. It was so pretty. Yeah. It was so powerful. Yeah. That's a lot. Yes. It's so good. I yes. cannot believe yes. yes. for six months. This is crazy. Alright, you uh, well, we're gonna go celebrate with family. And so. chocolate. And chocolate. <laughs> so thank you all so much for watching. Yes! Yes. If you've enjoyed this journey with us, drop a moon, especially crescent moon. Yes! And star. Oh. <laughs> Moons and stars for Say and Usagi. <laughs> yes! <laughs> In the comment section below. We look forward to connecting with you again soon, and we will be sending so much love. Till next time. Laters!